As we observe Veterans Day, we have the honor of speaking with a member of the greatest generation. The 94-year-old Portland man helped liberate a concentration camp during World War II. Our Amy Frazier got to sit down with him today and joins us now with more. Amy? Bernard Brown graduated from Salem High School back in 1943. He joined the Army and would soon be sent overseas in a fight for freedom that would change his life. It's been so many years ago, but it's still hard when it comes back. Time has passed. Still, Bernard Brown says what he survived during World War II has him counting his blessings. My whole life has been fortunate. He served in the U.S. Army and arrived in France in 1944. And we had a, an air raid as we were getting off the ship. So we went over on nets, the side of the ship, and... Uh, Many of us fell right into the, <laughs> into the craft below because it was, they were shooting all over the place. Germans. Later, during heavy fighting, he was hit with shrapnel. Still, he returned to his unit. Yeah, it made you appreciate life and how to take advantage of life and also share things with others. Always take care of those that needed it. His unit was the first to reach Dachau, liberating the concentration camp. They wanted water and they, they just were on their knees and so thankful that we were there. And that was sort of a difficult thing to see. Throughout the war, he wrote to his childhood friend Selma, who would later become his wife. They had three children, and he worked in Salem as an optometrist for 57 years. I was married to my wife for 72 years. To this day, he is proud to have served his country. Oh, no question. Very proud and thankful that I served. More thankful than I'm here to even talk about. Bernard Brown received several military honors, including the Bronze Star and the Purple Heart. In fact, just last year, he received a medal from France, thanking him for his courage and contributions to the cause of freedom. Back to you.